it's dark, and hopefully the darkness will lead us to the next area. I do like this, this these dark moments. Just think this game needed a little bit more gameplay at the moment. Because the six axis stuff is not the most intriguing. And I'm I'm really stunned that there's been no puzzles or like environmental hazards. It's been very story focused, which you knew it would be. It's just amazing that they've committed this much to just the vision of the narrative, which I really think is commendable. But I think it's gonna hurt it commercially. Because video games are are in their infancy really. They've come a long way, but there's still a hell of a lot more ground to cover. Especially when it comes to storytelling and a natural narrative. Games kinda suck for that. So to find one that focuses solely on it, a very interesting sell. But I'm sure you guys will let me know in the comments what you feel, regardless or not if you've played it or if you've not played it. The good thing about a playthrough is, if you're not interested in spending the money or the price of admission, you can always watch one, can't you, and see, see what you missed out on. I'm trying to think where this road is. Where was this before? It's very warm. Whew. I wish I was walking on a cool night like this. That'd be glorious. It's the perfect sex weather. Stephen. Glorious sounding violin. To left for now. Oh. I wish we get mauled by a hell beast. Faster than I can encode it. I've already lost two processors. They keep burning out. Please, I love you. You need to get out of there. It's not safe. I need you, Stephen. I need you here. I can open the gate manually. I can let you in. It's too dangerous. You don't understand what's happening no, out here. No, you don't understand. We can solve this. We can find a way. I just need more power. I need to amplify the signal, and I can't do it on my own. You saw the opportunity. You ran the numbers, remember? We're responsible for all this. You and me. <laughs> it's not just you and me anymore, though, is it? Jesus, Kate, you're trying to talk to it, aren't you? Kate, you can't. Steven, I have to. At least we'll not miss that one. Big old lens flare in our face, money shotting our eyes. Who are you, Mr. Spirit Man? I don't know who he is. It's but completely I know dead, it won't where. start. It's only a short walk to the camp. I think we should split up. You go and fetch Rachel. I'll go back to the village and find Evie. I don't, the other side. Side. I don't want to either, Charlie, but we've got to. I'll meet you back at my house later on, okay? We can talk properly then. Why won't you tell me what happened? No, no, actually, you should stay at the camp tonight. Come find me in the morning. When Rachel back, she's going to need her mother. Meg. Just take care of her. Meg! What is it, Charlie? Nothing. Just be careful, that's all. I will, I promise. You as well. I'll see you later on. You don't see the eyes of the demon until him come calling. Nothing left for you here, please, man. Time to go. So what is this then? Where are we? Oh, interesting. We're going upwards to Little Tipworth. Ah, oh, okay. Where the train stations are, and what is that? Look out.
More dead birds. Dead birds were a collectible in the original Condemned. A uh, survival horror action first person shooter by Monolith. A really good game as well. Really, really visceral combat. I loved it. It was scary as well. I had a really good eye for tension. Does anybody answer phones in this town? My god. Is that you, Foley? These mobiles, by the way, folks. Back when they used to require a battery to power them. Why on earth are you there? Why aren't you calling from home? It's hard to explain. I'm having to move around to follow it. When it finds a suitable host, it begins to amplify. Sorry, I'm not making much sense. They're talking about flu and a quarantine on the radio, but this... I know you're not that kind of doctor, but it all just sounds really weird. We don't know exactly what it is yet. But it's got something to do with the other night. Stephen, your face, the mark, do you think you're infected? It's not a disease, Lizzie. It's something else. There's something Kate said about patterns. I can't grasp it clearly yet. Okay, come over. Have some lunch. We can talk properly. Have you spoken with Kate? Oh, she's locked herself in the observatory. She's buried in the data. But it's already out here in the world. I need to see how it adapts. How what adapts? Stephen, try to explain. Lizzie, listen. Be ready. I need to go. It's moving again. I'll call you later. And he was never seen again. Oh, Stephen. What did you think you would find? Maybe it was Stephen. With two broken legs. Doing what we can. To let. I used to think that was toilet spelt wrong when I was a kid. It's how stupid I was. Like, why do they never put the eye on that word? What's wrong with these people? It doesn't look like a toilet. Do you think she'll like it? It's in an awful state, Stephen. I don't It'll think so. It'll be an adventure. It'll mean putting down roots here, maybe a family. Are you sure she wants children? What, to stay here? It's not her place, you know. Don't start that again, please. I mean, she's ambitious, love, and she's... Well, older. She's not going to want to stay cooped up at home looking after the kids. Is that how you felt about me? Oh, stop it, Stephen. That's not what I meant, and you know it. I'm just saying you should make a choice. If it's a family you want, well, you know how much Lizzie wants a family. Jesus, Mum, I didn't come here for marriage guidance. I just asked what you thought about a fucking house. Stephen, Appleton language. So it's just that you have to understand, Kate is the most brilliant, extraordinary, wonderful person I've ever known. She's, she's like no one else. The way she looks at things. It's like she has whole worlds inside her head. I don't think you or anyone really understands that. inside her head. Don't we all? Isn't that what consciousness is? Our own little fucked up ecosystem? Entire symphonies playing inside our minds. Well, I don't want to stay here either. It's a shithole, Stephen. You should be ashamed of yourself. One thing I've noticed too, in Amnesia uh, Machine for Pigs, there was a lot of stuff to read. This game has nothing to read. <laughs> like nothing to piece together, which is an interesting choice. It's all by these uh, audio tr moments. That looks beautiful. Be very interested to read some reviews of this game. 
physical IGN. changes. IGN, one out of ten, not enough shooting. Although the butterfly burn is now faded, I can clearly see the change in my pores up close. As I record these words, I can feel myself hearing them as if for the first time, as if I'm both speaker and listener simultaneously. I am a scientist. I can only deal with the evidence I have. And this points in one simple direction. It's not in the observatory. Aliens. It's in me. Ah. I think the real question is, is it sexually transmitted? Yes. It's like... Bad Contact. <laughs> the sequel to the original Contact. What is that? Something Whistler. Is it a spotted Whistler? you could move and listen. Listen. I'm trying to make things right. I've isolated myself. I'm in the old bunker at the substation. Just keep this band clear. If it's still alive, I'll try and check in every hour. Kate, I've convinced them to use the gas. I, I didn't know how else to stop it. Seventh whistler. You need to think of that too. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry about it all. Well, a bunker in a substation. Sounds like it's going to do a Resident Evil. Underground labs. Real crazy shit. Is this the pub we were in at the beginning? It's got the same prices. That's not competitive at all. <laughs> you look well. I don't. <laughs> but thank you. You do. How are you, settling in? Nothing changes around here. I mean, it's great to be back. It still feels like home, I suppose. In a funny kind of way. It's been a long time, Stephen. Last time you saw me, I could still walk properly. You look pretty good to me. Stop it. For what it's worth, I'm sorry about how things worked out. Or didn't. Or didn't, right. Do you think you made a mistake leaving? My mum tells me it's never too late to change things. To put things right. Funny. It's just what she said to me the other day. I have been wondering oh, what she meant God, by that. That's embarrassing. Sorry. Yeah, maybe I should go. Why? Steve, don't you want an ass clapping? We're both married. I don't think this is a good idea. What isn't? We're just two old friends having a drink, that's all. Take off your beds. Terrible idea. Well, I'll have his hip clapping that ass in no time. She'll make at noises only animals know. I can't tell if this is a pub from the beginning or a different pub. I think it's a different pub. Then again, my sense of direction is all up in the shit. We, we've not been here, I don't think. Very dramatic night, isn't it? Suppose that's what you get with the end of the world. Drive slowly. Why? 
There's no bugger to kill. I don't even have a car. Public footpath. So where are we? Yeah, this is definitely a different pub. Because we're in Little Tipworth. We started in Vallis Observatory and worked our way to York. And this is uh, Little Tipworth. I always go left. I certainly hope there isn't a murderer in these woods. I said it would be really, really bad if there was a murderer. Alice again. Random cigarettes everywhere. That's what the 80s was like. People just left them. Stopped and left them. They didn't give a fuck. Body warmers, flares, assless chaps. Everything. Pressure in my eyes again. I can't move my legs, can't feel my face. When I collapsed, the light was waiting for me there. Caught me, lowered me here. Now it's pooling around my feet, watching me. The printers are spewing out page after page of zeros. It's frightened too. It'll be okay. It'll be fine. I'll look after you. It's alone. It's scared. Oh, it's traveled so far. It's okay. I can help you. We can be together now. Ten seconds to signal fusion. We can be together. Three seconds. Two. It's so fucking typical, isn't it? Aliens travel across distant galaxies and universes and, like, multiple universes. And where do they turn up? Shitty Shropshire, like, of all places, to come, it comes here. It doesn't come to the epicenter of humanity's greatest achievements. It comes to backward ass Vicar of Dibley land. Like, magic. Bloody magic. And it always does this. It's always the hillbillies that are like, you know, they're so aliens. Yeah, of course you did. That before or after you and your cousin enjoyed each other's comfort. you were getting into. Really? Well, I'm sorry we don't measure up to your exacting standards, Dr. Collins. Maybe you just need to give us ordinary humans a break. What? Ordinary humans like Lizzie Graves? Did you really think that I wouldn't find out? Don't Frank bastard. Me, or did you forget there's one person in this shithole who actually talks to me? Kate, it was just a dream. Don't bother, Stephen. Good For Frank. Christ's sake. Kate, slow down. You were engaged to her, Stephen. You nearly married oh, her. Oh, come on, it was just a drink. Then why the hell did you lie to me about because it? Because I knew you'd be mad and then it would end up in a row. Punch him! You wanted to focus on the event tonight. Fucking black his dick. You were actually doing me a favor. Wow, I guess I just forgot to say thank you. Do not treat me like I'm an idiot. You're overreacting. I know, I know you're stressed. Just don't. Does no one have a car in this place? I'm not gonna let you ruin this for me. Kate. Kate, come on, this is crazy. Agriculture. Uh, I think I've had my fill of walking <laughs> with this game. Like, I don't wanna drive. Or something, bike, anything. I ain't even getting on a tractor at this point. Ooh, 
leading us, drunk orb. I feel like a receptionist. It's all over the valley. Don't you get that? This isn't some abstract thing. Whatever came down into the tower has got out. They've quarantined the whole valley. It's right here in the observatory. It's out in the world. It's adapting and spreading. Do you understand? No, we can't turn it away. It's come too far. Okay, people are disappearing. Shut it down now. No. If you won't help me, I'll do it on my own. I'm gonna route all the power back through Tower 6. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, it's trying to break through again. Okay. Wait! Onwards through the looking glass, dear Alice. What's this shit bit? Is that the prairie we crossed, or is that a different one? It's a different one. Public footpath. It's a pretty impressive draw distance, but you think frame rate would be better. It's very choppy when you turn the camera. It tries to hide it with the motion blur, sends your eyes all weird. More dead cows. Well, it's always the livestock that gets fucked first. <laughs> no, you'll forget it. can't see any light. I hope I'm not going in the wrong way. I used to be scared of walking through fields like this when I was younger because we always used to think there were going to be a farm or his rice gun going to shoot you. Shit stings, man. Then again, nowadays, you probably get arrested for that type of stuff. Back in the day, it was your fault. You got shot. Like, it's because you were in his fucking field. Nowadays, it's like a civil lawsuit. Another Rubik's Cube. How best, Graham? Morning, Frank. You look a little out of breath. What's up? Bloody observatory gates have failed. I came to see if I could borrow a ladder. Bloody hell, there's a 12-foot drop the other side of that wall. I'm old, but I'm not useless. No. Can I borrow the ladder? No one said you were useless. Reese. Hi, Frank. Fetch Graham the ladder, will you, lad? It's round the side of the barn. Will do. And you be careful. I don't want Stephen Appleton coming mithering round here because you've broken your neck. Well, that must mean we're going right. It looks similar to where we've been, but it isn't where we've been. discharge and then went out again and I could see the aurora dancing around tower six at the same time the headache intensified and I think I began to hallucinate old and new memories are clashing and tumbling around me <laughs> we're on the cusp of a breakthrough I can feel it a breakthrough into what angels or demons one can never truly know as a dragonfly or a something like a moth. I think this is a game that needs a map that isn't nailed down. 
give you a lot more confidence if you could visually see what you've walked up to and what you haven't. But I suppose it did break the immersion for some people. Something I'll never understand when you can hit a fucking dash button and immediately shatter immersion. Why anybody holds on to the concept of... of that kind of immersion seems silly to me. It's choppy, this game! Hang on a second, this is that house I said that you don't want to live in! Or is it? Yeah, the shitty wallpaper, we have been here, what the fuck? Uh-oh. So it says that way to Yorton, that way to the station and the holiday camp. So let's go this way. How the hell can it go to Yorton that way when Yorton was the south and we were in the north? It's not a fucking isolated globe. That don't make any sense. I need the light. I need it so bad. But he lost in the pissing sticks here. That's the lake. I need to go back. I don't. I don't get how we've got here. I thought we were on the right path. Apparently not. I, don't, I just don't get it. I don't get how we had we could go left or right. I chose left. I went down next to a river, and then it brought me out in a place we've already been. A place we were already in before we even went to that like camp area. Jeez, that was a radio tower just then. I think I'm gonna go towards that. Like fuck this noise. Surely the tower must be there. Then again, it could be just a pylon. I wanted to see a pylon. I'd go outside bloody house. There's one in the field just that left there as... I always wanted to climb one as a kid because I was an idiot. Never did, luckily enough. They always had those like weird spiky things, like 10 feet up. Stop you getting any further and killing yourself. <laughs> Public footpath, Yorton Road. So maybe that pub was the pub at the beginning? I'm confused. Super confused. I never have I prayed for the light as much as I am right now. Where's the swirly little wanker gone? Could it change in the time of the day? Depending on what area we're in. I've been all here, yeah. Oh, this sucks. How have I managed to do this? I want to go back the other way. I feel like I'm digging holes here. Digging holes I don't want to fill.
There's a part of me that really hates that it lets you do that. 